What is the most underreported story so far of the Obama administration? The most underreported story? The most story? underreported story. It's a very good question. I have to stop for a second and think about it. Um, I think it is that nobody has gone around and looked at his secondary appointments and how radical they are. Uh, when you start looking at the people he's been appointing to various jobs below the cabinet, there are patterns of extraordinary radicalism in their writing, in their teaching, in their attitudes. And I think that that's probably the most underreported story. I think the second story, which gets a little bit of coverage but has much very profound impact, nobody in the Obama senior team has a clue how to create jobs. I mean, the closest you come is an academic professor like, like uh, Larry Summers, but the truth is Larry Summers is an academic. He's not a job creator. And so the president has nobody around him who has any common sense, practical understanding of what small business goes through and what you do to start jobs and how you raise capital and all that stuff. And the result is, in what is, I think, one of the things that's going to make this a one-term president, uh, you have uh, no ability to craft positive programs that work. And I, I think people sort of occasionally report that, but I think the depth of its importance that, remember, in California and Michigan, if you count unemployed part-time workers and those who quit looking, you're at almost 20%, almost every fifth person. And you don't have anything like an appropriate level of focus in this administration on job creation. And I think that's because, frankly, they don't know what to do and they don't have anyone in the room who knows what to do. And just as a quick follow-up, um, on you said that that lower level of appointments, anyone specifically stand out to you? Well, the, the, the chief counsel at, at the State Department is a person who basically believes in subordinating the United States to international law. Now, if you really look at that seriously, it's a, it's a horrifyingly bad idea. That would be a typical example. 